top 10 places to visit in Mexico. Mexico is becoming increasingly popular with visitors from far and wide who want to enjoy endless sunshine, stunning scenery, and beautiful sandy beaches, not to mention its amazingly rich cultural heritage. The whole experience is complemented by the country's rich culture, a fascinating mix of indigenous and colonial Spanish influences, reflected in everything from the country's culinary creations to its vibrant music and dance traditions. It is also rich in flora and fauna, as it straddles all climate zones from arid deserts to lush rainforests. To help you plan the best Mexico itinerary possible, we have compiled a list of the best places to visit in Mexico. Let's look into them together. Number 10. Malugue. Here you can find a beautiful freshwater river that brings water to this dry desert. There you can get some incredible views of the oasis from a great viewpoint. You can choose between many recreational activities including museum exhibitions and historic sites that feature the historic and brave town roots and its culture and traditions. You can also choose a tour and enjoy many recreational activities in the Sea of Cortes. Concepcion Bay is the ace up Malugues leaf with various beaches where you can practice your favorite water sports under the smoldering Baja California sun. Other must-see sites are the Santa Rosalia de Mulegue Mission and a museum that served as a person in town. Like any coastal town, Mulegue offers exquisite marine delicacies from the sea. Several local restaurants serve meals throughout the day. You can also find a bar with the live music. In general, there are great places to dine and for every budget too. Number 9. La Paz one of the most underrated destinations, La Paz, Mexico, is the vibrant capital of city of Baja California Sur. It has very little feel of a big city and more of a happy port town brimming with amazing scenic views and exciting things to do for sea lovers. There are so many things you can do in La Paz. You could watch the sunset from the Malecon, spend a day in Playa Balandra, join a tour to Spiritu Santo, join a tour to swim with the whale sharks or if you need some time alone you can walk around the city to admire the beautiful murals you could stay at la posada hotel and beach club la paz and it is situated at a one minute walk from the beach in la paz and three kilometers from the city center this beautiful contemporary property features also an outdoor pool for those who wish to enjoy the tranquility of the hotel a gym and a spa with the Damis Calzana and beauty treatments. All the stylish suits have ocean views with a private balcony or terrace. Number 8. Holbox. Holbox is a tropical paradise where visitors can escape mainland crowds of Tulum or Cancun. The beauty of Halbox is the simplicity, the nature, and the slow the rhythm that it has and that exists in. Art, happiness, and a sense of calm abound everywhere. When you are here, you can help but just slow down and take it all in. It is a refreshing destination free from congestion and stress. Hallbox is one of the most famous places in the Caribbean to see the massive whale sharks. These exquisite creatures eat plankton, so no need to worry about getting scarfed down in their presence. Have you ever seen glowing blue water? If not, you must check out the bioluminescent waters of Hallbox at night. In Hallbox, you can enjoy every day, be lazy and wander through the town center. You can also admire the brightly painted buildings, eat delicious food like the famous lobster pizza, savor a tropical cocktail, and lounge in a sea hammock. Number 7. Bacalar 
If you're looking for a magical destination that will take you far away from the hordes of tourists and Mexican resort towns, look no further than Bacalar. A truly enchanting and off-the-beaten-path adventure awaits on a trip to Bacalar, located on the sparkling crystal waters of La Laguna de los Siete Colores, or the Lagoon of Seven Colors. The pristine blue waters of the natural lagoon are unforgettable, and the lovely and culturally rich Puebla makes Bacalar one of Mexico's best kept secrets. Even though the town is low key, there are still plenty of things to do in Bacalar to keep you busy. It is a perfect place for you if you're looking to immerse yourself in Mexican culture and also try out adventurous activities like kayaking or stand up paddle boarding. Number 6. San Cristobal Set in a gorgeous highland valley surrounded by pine forests, the colonial city of San Cristobal has been a popular destination for decades. It's a pleasure to explore San Cristobal's cobbled streets and markets, soaking up the unique ambiance and the wonderfully clear highland light. Surrounded by dozens of traditional Sotzil and Celtal villages, San Cristobal is at the heart of one of the most deeply rooted indigenous areas in Mexico. A great base for local and regional exploration, it's also a place where ancient customs coexist with modern luxuries. There is so much to love about San Cristobal and so many amazing places to explore in the surroundings that you will definitely have to include this pretty town in your list of the places to visit in Mexico. The only risk you run is that you will fall in love and never want to leave. Number 5. Mazatlán, Sinaloa among Mexico's safest coastal destinations, Mazatlán is still one of the less visited by tourists, which means the 20-mile stretch of sandy shores won't be overrun by people. The food scene is one of the most dynamic in the country. Mazatlán's beachfront locale brings bountiful seafood to tables across the city daily. Plus, the Pacific Pearl, as the city is sometimes called, happens to be in Sinaloa, the state that provides a full third of the entire nation's produce. A bulk of the agricultural production is small-scale, family-farmed, and inherently organic. It's always been that way, so you can expect pure, fresh food items whenever you find yourself in the region. Number 4. Malecón the Malecón is a popular beachside promenade in Puerto. You can watch street performance under the palm trees, sample a variety of Mexican street food, and enjoy the sunset over the ocean. Have I told you that the Malecón is a great place to sample the local cuisine? Well, it is. You can try a piece of grilled fish on a skewer for lunch or grilled corn with lemon or cheese. A serving of cold tejuino is great on a hot day. The fermented ice drink is very popular in this part of Mexico, and it is made from the same corn dough as tortillas. At night, you can try out tuba, an alcoholic coconut drink that can include walnuts or apple. The malecón is also lined with a sit-down restaurant line for more formal dining. You can choose to walk the length of the malecón to see juggling acts, mimes and musicians playing traditional Mexican folk music. On the beach, the impressive sand sculptures carved by local artists provide a number of great photo opportunities. The Malecón is also the fashion district of Puerto Vallarta. You can find many clothes, jewelry, and leather outlets along the walkway. Number 3. Cabo San Lucas and the Los Cabos Corridor at the southern tip of the beautiful Baja Peninsula is Los Cabos, often referred to simply as Cabo. 
It is one of Mexico's top beach destinations. It consists of a large stretch of coastline that extends from the towns of Cabo, San Lucas, and San Jose del Cabo, and known as the Los Cabos Corridor. This 30-kilometer stretch of pristine beaches attracts visitors for its clear waters, diving, snorkeling, and fishing. It also hosts the world's largest marlin contest. Numerous resorts have sprung up that cater to all tastes and budgets, from luxurious spas to Gulf Center properties offering some of the best courses in North America. Number 2. Puerto Vallarta Another of Mexico's increasingly popular beach destinations is the Pacific coastal city of Puerto Vallarta. Often shortened to just Vallarta, the city first appeared on the vacation radar in the 1960s as a playground for North America's social elite and has since become extremely popular among tourists looking for second homes in a sunny, warmer climate. The city also boasts many locations to shop for arts and crafts or to simply stroll along pleasant beachside promenades with their many green spaces and sculptures. Number 1. Cancun and the Maya Riviera Lying along a beautiful stretch of coastline on the Gulf of Mexico are the resort's destination of Cancun, Playa del Carmen, the island of Cozumel, and beyond. Collectively, these are known as the Riviera Maya. This magnificent area along the eastern edge of the Yucatan Peninsula attracts some 5 million visitors each year, in the process generating huge tourist revenues. Despite these numbers, you're unlikely to feel like a part of the crowd due to the Riviera's wide beaches, endless crystal clear water, and plethora of best all-inclusive resorts. The area also boasts numerous fun things to do, such as dolphin and stingray swings snorkeling among reefs in tropical fish, as well as scuba diving in the world's largest underwater museum, a spectacular collection of sculptures submerged at depths of up to 8 meters. <laughs> 